my youtube channel it is your favorite favorite baby girl once again yeah this is the Oseke's family if you're watching me for the first time hello welcome to this great family i'm a mommy vlogger based in anambra state on nature a beautiful mom of three beautiful kids yeah so today i want to discuss my struggles on youtube and as a content creator so before we dive into this video please don't forget to like the video drop a comment share if possible and please always watch our ads okay yeah let's dive into the video guys most of you guys will know me this has been my three years on youtube three years on this platform and it has not been easy at all it has not been easy on me it has not been easy at all when i say easy it has not been easy three years ago uh, when I started YouTube, I was watching other people's video on YouTube. I was so addicted to YouTube videos before I decided to start up my own YouTube videos. Okay, so I was watching other people's content, watching other people's video, and I decided to say, mm, okay, let me just start up my own. If other mothers and other other fellow women can do it, I can also do it. So I started up. A YouTube video thinking that it's just to create content and just post it and relax and people will watch not knowing that you have to put a whole lot of work I didn't even know that YouTube pays that is the main truth I think you have to go through some signing and all of that but when I met a youtuber who has been helping me you know telling me that I can make money on YouTube I can do this on YouTube I was like wow okay but she insists that I must be consistent on youtube back then i was a mother giving birth back to back having three kids under three years going to school okay being a housewife it was so hard on me so i was not posting consistently like that i was posting once in two weeks or once in three weeks okay so i was not so consistent like that until I decided I concluded this year that okay um no not this year about ending of last year I decided okay let me take this YouTube of a thing serious since I'm ending my education as an uh, I'm a graduate so I I started posting up here consistently I told my husband YouTube is something I want to focus I want to put my energy and every other thing on so we started buying equipment for YouTube ring light stand camera laptop you know my husband support me one thing I love my husband is that he's a great supporter he support me in everything I put my mind on if he sees that I'm interested in this he's going to support me that is one thing I'm blessed with that man is so supportive so I made inquiries of what camera is going to give me a good quality what people would love to watch my videos I went for editing I went to learn editing about three months I paid okay that is how serious it was i paid for editing i went to the classes to learn how to edit to learn how to film because it was my first time using a camera to film i've never used camera in my life before but youtube made me to realize that camera was necessary so my husband went to buy camera and you know that back then camera was so expensive not to talk of now that dollar is increasing and all of that so my husband really put money really put money on this youtube of a thing so as a content creator i started by marriage counselor i didn't start by um daily vlog if you are watching most of my videos my old videos you see that i i i normally talk about marriage how to maintain your marriage your relationship because that was what i studied i mean I'm a counselor, guidance and counselor, okay? So I studied this, so I talked more on how to maintain marriage, relationship, how to, you know, um, um, build your marriage with your husband. I realized that that was not what people want to watch at all. People don't want to watch whatever that will, you know, help their marriage and all of that. So I decided, okay, let me be doing daily vlog because I normally watch people's vlog. I dine at a QMA, Nello, all these big big youtubers i normally watch their vlogs i said okay um i think this is what people this is what viewers want 
to be watching like vlog with your kids and all of that so i decided to change my niche to leave marriage counselor and dive into vlogging lifestyle motherhood and every other thing etc so i talked to my husband because before you show your children on camera this is what you and your husband need to discuss i talked to my husband he gave me his support he said good and fine if that is what is going to make you happy i'm also in but my husband is not the camera type so i understood his own part i started vlogging with my kids okay so i started gaining viewers and all of that i said okay this is what people actually want i dive into vlogging full-time vlogging and <laughs> my struggles as a content creator is that i lack viewers i lack viewers okay i lack viewers and I don't know how to explain this. It's really eating me up most of the time. Sometimes I will even overlook it and say, by the way, I'm just doing it for fun because I love camera. I would just say I love camera. I love creating content and uploading it up there. But it's so sad that whenever you come to check your um to check how well your videos is going, you will see that your videos is not going anywhere. All your energy to create if you know me you know that i'm pregnant all my energy to create content um to upload it here to do my thumbnail before i was not good on i was not good in creating thumbnail until i went to learn on how to create thumbnail so everything okay so i just said the things start eating me up the things start bothering me and all of that i was not saying to myself is it because I'm not creating enough. I'm not. I don't know. I don't. I actually, I don't know where the problem was coming from. But at a point, I decided to to overlook it, to just let it go. So I, there's a video I made with my daughter last year, which is she is no more. I made with my daughter last year a night nice routine with a newborn. I made that video with her, and the video reached about five thousand something viewers. I noticed that that was what people love at that moment. So I started creating videos. I started getting viewers as well. There is no light, so I'm feeling hot. I started getting viewers as well. So actually, the thing there now is that I'm not getting viewers as I am supposed to. Okay, because I don't know. I don't know if it's YouTube. I don't know if it's because my videos are not okay. I don't really know. It's really stressing me out, but uh, I can't keep myself. I don't really know. Sometimes I watch other people's videos to compare with my own to see maybe if there's any way I'm making any mistake or, you know, by editing or by something I'm not doing okay. Sometimes I see people that I am better than. My videos are even better than their own, but they have much viewers and I'm having less viewers. But it is what it is. I'm not even talking about my subscribers. Uh, people that subscribed to me this past few months, last month stroke this month, people that subscribed was like about 50 people that subscribed to me, to my channel. But if I tell you that uh, YouTube have removed them, as in have, have removed the subscribers, you will be shocked because... I'm supposed to be hitting 3k by now, but yet I'm still in 2,000 something subscribers because and whenever they subscribe, I'm the kind of person that always go to my YouTube studio. YouTube studio is my second home. So I go there to check on my videos to see how well it is going. But um, when I went to check last, I noticed that my 50 subscribers is gone. YouTube removed it. I don't know if they unsubscribed, but I'm sure that YouTube are the ones behind it because it's no longer there and i was so frustrated i was so paranoid i was so angry i was telling my husband that's like i will quit this youtube and go and look for a job because you know in nigeria marriage counselor is something you have to stay under an organization to run okay i was saying after all i'm a graduate let me go and focus on my um on my career as a guidance and counseling 
okay so i studied two courses in school actually i studied um primary education that is being a lecturer and i studied guidance and counseling six years in school after studying lecturing at, um, after studying my primary education in ACE, I booked another form for degree for my guidance and counselling. So I studied two courses under six years. With having kids back to back and also being a housewife and all of that. So I was talking to my husband and see this time around it's like I'm going to pursue my career because YouTube is not giving me giving me what I want. I started by doing a giveaway. If you noticed, I do give away, like give away just for people to, you know, engage in my channel and, and all of that. It leave, this thing they chop me money, you guys don't know. This thing eats me a whole lot of money. Doing a giveaway, buying ring lights. Okay, one of us won the ring lights giveaway, which I delivered and she, she has shown it on her channel okay that she has gotten the giveaway so i came up a few months ago to you know give a laptop as a giveaway but i it came to my notice that why wasting this kind of money on things that are not relevant because after doing this giveaway people will disengage themselves from my channel only when there is giveaway that is when i'm seeing people but once i just the giveaway is done People will just leave the channel. So I decided to, you know, um, hold that giveaway for laptop. I said for now, not that I'm not going to do it, but for now I'm not going to be doing the giveaway anymore until I see a positive result on my YouTube channel. Okay? Yeah, because whenever I post videos, people will be asking me when are you doing the giveaway, when are you doing the giveaway, when are you doing the giveaway. For now, I'm not doing any giveaway for now. Because how can I be doing giveaway and yet I'm not gaining anything? But you guys are gaining, but I'm not gaining anything. So at this point, I'm not going to be doing any giveaway at this point, okay? Yeah, so that is it. Um, That has been my struggles, viewers, subscribers. Has been my struggle seriously I don't know if there's anything I'm doing wrong if my content are not interesting please guys I want you guys to help me out if my content are not being interesting if there's something I lack on my video if the editing is not okay just let me know every day people learn I'm I'm the kind of person that even a five years old child can correct me I don't mind I don't have that kind of pride okay so please tell me if my videos are not perfect if there's something you guys want me to really do on my content to really do on my video just let me know if the editing is not perfect i'm going to improve i don't mind paying another money to go and learn editing again okay that is how far i can go i'm just want to try this this past few months if it's not giving me what i want i'll quickly delete myself okay i'll delete myself and you know find something else to do that is going to be giving me what i want because i am monetized i i, I have in fact i am monetized okay we have about two thousand something subscribers but 500 viewers we can't find in my video except except so many people that do share my videos i want to say a very big i want to use this opportunity to say a very big thank you to um vicky's corner that has been sharing my videos share my videos to help me grow thank you so much sis i really appreciate you i love you so much and i'm going to surprise you one day that is a promise that i'm making never have just brought the light that is the promise i'm making i'm going to really surprise you you don't know who i am you don't know when i love somebody ah oh god when i love someone yeah i can do anything everything for that person i want to say thank you so much sis for sharing my videos i want to also thank um, mary queen tv for also sharing my videos for you know she's the winner she's the one that won our ring light giveaway and she keeps on coming back to my channel sharing my videos even though she doesn't know me the love she has for me is too much and i'm i'm, I'm promising you all that i'm going to surprise you i want to also thank this lady this beautiful lady okay a sister of mine i really love her so much 
um, the Zams family. She also share my videos most of the, most of the times. She will share my videos and all of that. I want to say a very big thank you to each and every one of you for that massive love. God will surely, surely bless you all for helping this pregnant woman. God will surely, surely bless each and every one of you. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. So back to what I was saying. I will try this for let's say six months let me see if there's going to be any results i don't mind giving out my camera and everything as a giveaway because um, what is the game i'm buying data okay most of the times i don't sleep most of the times i don't sleep i'm um, calculating what content am i to bring to the table what vlog am i to bring to the table that will make people to watch and also come back next time if i want to upload or if i upload any video for them to watch but shockingly for you a channel that has almost 2000 something subscribers cannot even gain 500 viewers it is somehow it is somehow it is heartbroken it is you know annoying and all of that but I don't know. Okay, not even talking about the viewers. Let's talk about the subscribers. Why is it to be removing my subscribers? Why is it that whenever I want to climb up, YouTube will bring me down? I don't get it. I don't really know what is going on. So please, if you have any suggestion, if you know why this is happening to my channel, please let me know. And I'm really going to appreciate. Just drop a comment at the comment section. Okay, I don't really want to cry <laughs> because seriously, seeing other people grow, you see a video that will upload that, and when, when you get to that video, you see that there's nothing meaningful there. You will just waste your data at the end of the day. You say, So, this is what I waste my data to watch. But the person will have viewers, but you that will upload meaningful things, you know how much time you have put in, in that video, you know how much time you put in editing. Yet you will not get any viewers. It's somehow it's so annoying. But I put everything into the hands of God. The, it's only God that know how I started this YouTube, and He will be the one to help me at the end of the day. Okay, guys, this is what I started to bring in here. This has been my struggle as a content creator and as a YouTuber living in Anambra State on nature. So if you have any suggestion, if you have any opinion, if you have things to tell me, please try and do at the comment section. Don't forget to like, don't forget to share, don't forget to drop a comment, don't forget to subscribe to this great family. I am promising you guys, you will not regret it, okay? So this is where I will end the vlog and I will be expecting to get a reply from each and every one of you. Please share this video if you can so that I will get more opinion on other people. So, yeah, this should be the end of the vlog. So, see you guys in our next video. As for now, bye bye.